The reward significantly increases a reward leading to an arrest in the Colin Brown case. Tens of thousands of dollars were added and hope someone will come forward. Let's go to Fox 2's Laura Simon. She joins us live from police headquarters in downtown St. Louis. Good morning, Laura. Good morning, John. So that reward has now increased to $25,000, which is significantly higher than the usual $5,000 reward. And this is all thanks to family, friends and anonymous donors coming forward in hopes St. Louis Metropolitan Police can solve this crime. So it has been 10 days since Colin Brown was struck by a bullet on I-55. It was a stray bullet, police say, and the 16 year old CBC Jr. had a long life ahead of him. He had so much going for him as a hockey player at CBC, truly a star player and family and friends just are missing him tremendously. As you can imagine, he was on his way home from a hockey game with his dad. They were in the car when a stray bullet struck Colin in the neck. He tragically died four days later. Police say it is unknown who fired the gun or where it was fired from, but Crime Stoppers is now offering that $25,000 reward for information that leads to an arrest. And the Crime Stoppers tip hotline does not record names or phone numbers, ensuring that all calls remain anonymous. In addition to that, several groups are adding thousands of dollars to this reward money and hope someone anyone will come forward. Carl Lund lives in the St. Louis area. He says he doesn't know the family personally, but he is chipping in $10,000 of his own money for information leading to an arrest and conviction in this case. He tells us this story deeply touched him and hits home. I couldn't imagine something like this happening on the way home or anywhere else to anybody. It's a nightmare. The St. Louis Metropolitan Police Department did post a flyer to social media and it says if you know something, say something and they say no amount of information is too little. So if you do know anything, you can call Crime Stoppers to leave that anonymous tip at 1-866-371-TIPS. There is also a website where you can leave anonymous tips as well. We will post a link to that over on our website, fox2now.com. Reporting live downtown outside of police headquarters this morning, Laura Simon, Fox 2 News.